week 54 in the House of Horror. I just want to apologise that my review is kind of late today. It's because my computer was full with viruses this morning and my dad managed to sort it out so that's the reason why I'm late but I've still managed to get it uploaded. I'll get straight on with it. The movie that I'm reviewing today is Evil. Um, this was made in 2005. It's Greek with um, English subtitles. The director is Yorgos No Sias. Um, produced also by him and he also writ it. Um, the co-producers are Lambros Trefilis, Petros Nusayas and Claudio Bolivar. The cast is Miletis G Georgiadis as Miletis, um, Argyris um, Thanos Soulos as Argyris, Pepe Mosco Moschavoku as Marina, Mary Sone as Jenna, Nikos Sambalis as Andreas, um, Stavrula Tomopoulos Tupulu as Dimitra, um, Andreas Kontopoulos as Lieutenant Vakirtsis. I um, must apologise for this, I'm not very good at pr um, pronouncing Greek names. Um, Yanis Katsambas as Giannis, and Daphne Lerune as Daphne. The synopsis of this is an evil force is awakened downtown in downtown Athens, transforming the unsuspected citizens into flesh hungry zombies. The few survivors will have to fight hard to stand a chance of living in this zombie infested city. And I'll get straight on to my opinions on it. Um, I first came across this movie about three years ago in the second hand box at my local blockbuster and was immediately interested because of the awesome comic book style um, cover and the gory still look from the film on the back. Um, and this film has been referred to um, as similar to the early Splatterfests by Peter Jackson and Sam Raimi and um, I can understand why. Um, it did really remind me of um, Peter Jackson's earlier stuff like Brain Dead and Bad Taste. And I think for Grease's first Splatter film um, they did a good job and made it for only 140,000 euros, so it's pretty cheap. Um, the director did a good job and there were some good scenes, like a guy turning into a, a zombie um, in a packed stand of a football match, and obviously there was lots of easy prey around him, he was just infecting loads of people. Obviously, it's not a zombie film, it's more of an infection film. Let me get that straight, and the zombies are running zombies, so I just want to get that straight because I know a lot of you don't like running zombies. Um, another scene was um, a zombie falling out of an high rise apartment block and falling onto the road and then jumping up and attacking um, people in the street. That was very good. The acting was even, some actors did a great job, um, some were okay, but none were really bad, so that it was really low budget. I've seen a lot worse. Um, the blood and gore was great um, and very similar to Bad Taste and Brain Dead. Definitely more Bad Taste, but yeah, they did a great job. And overall, I thought this movie was a cool low budget movie, zombie movie. I enjoyed it from start to finish. I'm going to give it a 5.5 out of 10. Um, I know there's um, a really hard to find sequel out there somewhere. I've been trying to find it because I did enjoy this, but I can't find it nowhere. So if anybody can find it for me, let me know. And yeah, I'll give this a 5.5 out of 10. So thanks guys, I'll see you all next week.